The latest firmware update improves the battery life of the converter and changes the functionality, where the tap to wake function is replaced with the low power sleep mode. The converter will be ready to connect once you start cycling and connect through your favorite cycling training app. For firmware update, download the app free on Google Play or the App Store. Launch the app and scan for the converter. The app will connect and wake up the converter as indicated by the flashing green light. Go ahead and hit update firmware. The converter will show a solid green light during update. The app will indicate when the update is complete and the converter will show a flashing red light. Now you'll need to pair your converter to your bike again. To do that, simply open the converter Start cycling to turn on the display, then close the converter near the bike display to pair. This all happens quickly, one flash of the red light and it's paired. Now if you feel that pairing was missed for any reason or to pair to a different M3i, simply reopen and close the converter to reset. The converter will automatically enter pairing mode for 30 seconds. Now let's check the converter's new functionality. Now if it's your first time connecting to your cycling app, check to make sure Bluetooth is on. Do not connect from your device's Bluetooth settings. You will connect the converter directly to the app from within the app's pairing screen. Now keep in mind, location services may need to be turned on within your device settings. Here, I'm using Zwift on an iOS device. Launch the application, select your user, and enter the pairing screen. Now start cycling. Your converter will wake up and connect automatically. No more tap to awake. For first time setup, select ride, then power source. Note the converter will be identified as M3i, pound or number sign, followed by a number ID. Go ahead and select, then hit OK to connect. We'll do the same for cadence. Hit let's go to start your ride. At the end of your ride, you would end and save data as you normally would, or just kill the app. The flashing green light on the converter will stop, and this indicates a low power sleep mode ready for your next ride. The converter will automatically turn on and connect to the app the next time you launch and start pedaling.